Hi, my name is Andrea and today I'm gonna show you how to make these succulent planters. I made them from last week when I made this bench and I cut the legs. First, I measure all of my pieces. Safely use your power tools, use hearing, eye and dust protection. Then I start the cut. Oh wait, I forgot to plug it in. I mark the center of each planter and drill the pilot hole for a self-feeding Forstner bit. I change to my 2 inch Forstner bit and set the drill to maximum torque. Then I clamp two blocks to prevent twisting of the piece when drilling. This drill has a lot of torque and it's a real beast. Then I use 3 8 spade bit to drill drainage holes. I also had some cutoffs of this bench I wanted to use for planters. So I used the spade bit and impact drill driver to drill the hole. Well, that was fun. Then I drilled other piece and it hit my camera. And no one hits my camera. The barbecue was better than ever. <laughs> okay, back to the project. I used bell sander to sand all of the surfaces using 80 followed by 120 grits on paper. Then I use palm plane to round over sharp edges. I love this plane. Then I sanded everything with 220 grit sandpaper. More mishaps. I put thinner into the cup and I dip the brush for 3 minutes. Then the brush was like new. Here I was mixing some wood primer, uh, it's a wood sealer. And I wiped the dust of all the pieces and I applied the primer everywhere to seal the wood. I then decided to spill the sealer on my table, so I can immediately apply the second coat. I used leftover to seal the insides and forgot about that 3 8 hole I made earlier. When all the planters were dried, I sanded them all with 220 grit sandpaper. Finally, I can apply my beeswax finish. After 30 minutes has passed, I wipe the excess. Then my lovely wife Barbara plants them all. This project is dedicated to her. And here they are, beautiful home decor. Like comment, share and subscribe for more of my videos. Thanks for watching!